Hello again, Adam here. And now we're going to talk about the image capture from Rico 360 tours. So this is what we're going to do when we go to the property and we want to start taking some photos. So I'm going to demo this on my iPhone. If you're an Android user, it's going to be the exact same process on your phone. So let me bring up my screen. All right. So here we are in the Rico 360 tours app. It's going to be this app, the Rico 360 Tours app, the red one. Now, when we first go into the Rico 360 Tours app, we're going to use the red button at the bottom, new tour. First thing I'm going to do is punch in an address. Done. Now I'm ready to begin. So in this screen, I have three options. I have the Theta camera. I have my phone camera and the phone library. The Theta camera is the Rico Theta. That's the bulk, if not the entirety of what we're gonna do. But then I also have my phone camera in case I wanna grab a quick still, I can do so. Now, I also have the phone's library. So if I have photos already taken on this phone, I can import them directly into the tour from the library. In most cases, of course, we're going to go with the Theta. So that's what we're going to do now. Now I'm going to position my camera outside of my office and we'll take a photo together. So I'm going to select the Theta. Of course, I'm going to allow all access and I'm going to select my registered Theta and connect. Now, once I get the live preview, I'll be able to see what the camera sees and I'll be able to take the photo. Here I can pan around, make sure everything is staged correctly. And when I'm ready, I fire the camera remotely using the shutter button at the bottom of the screen. The camera is going to take the photo. It's going to take a true 360, a photo from each lens. It's going to stitch that together and it's going to process the photo and send it over to my phone. So here comes the photo. And now I label the photo call it a backyard and done. At this point, I would actually pick up the camera, move to the next position and use add next photo to continue the process. Or when you get to the last photo, you're gonna select done. That photo is being synced to the cloud and that is the image capture process. Thank you, have a great day.